Hello everyone, you are watching my YouTube channel Chemistry by Sadhan Warren. Today we are going to discuss a harder IGCSE past paper question. Which sample does not contain a number of atoms equals to Avogadro constant? Here the thing is number of atoms equal to Avogadro constant. So Avogadro constant is 6.02 times 10 raised to the power 23 particles. Let's see why option A does not correct here. Option A is 14 gram of nitrogen. You know, if I choose, if I choose one mole of nitrogen, one mole of nitrogen, it means I am, it means I am talking about 6. 0, 02 times 10 raised to 10 raised to, 10 raised to 23 molecules of nitrogen and one mole of nitrogen means 28 gram so 28 gram of nitrogen has 6.02 times 10 raised to power 23 molecules and one nitrogen contained two nitrogen atoms so it would have two times 6.02 times 10 raised to power 23 nitrogen atoms but I have 14 grams, so I divide 28 by 2 to make it half. As I, as I did here, I have to do the same thing here, divide by 2, because for 28 gram, this is the number of atoms. So for 14 gram, number of atoms would be half. So I divide by half to make, I divide by 2 to make it half. So 14 gram would have 6.02 times 10 raised to power 23. So option A, we can't say this is equal to Avogadro constant. Let's see option B, 6 gram of water. I now 18 gram of water, it would have 6.02 times 10 raised to power 23 molecules of water. And if I talk about atoms, then one water molecule has three atoms. So 6.02 times 10 raised to power 23 molecule would have three times 6.02 times 10 raised to power 23. But in the option B, I have six gram. I don't have 18 gram. So I divide 18 by three to make it six gram. So here I have to do same thing, divide by three. So when I divide by three, means I can say 6 gram of water would have 6.02 times 10 raised to power 23 atoms. So option B is like this. Now let's talk about option C. Let's see in option C. 4 gram. Atomic mass of helium is 4 as well. So this is 1 mole. And you guys know 1 mole of atom because helium exists as atomic form. So this is equals to 6.02 times 10 raised to power 23. Now the remaining option is D, that is the correct answer, but I have to solve it. D, 28 gram. You guys know molar mass of carbon monoxide is 12 plus 16, this is 28 as well. So 28 gram by 28 gram per mole, this is one mole. So one mole of CO means 6.02 times 10 to the power 23, you can say molecules of CO. But I am talking about atoms. So I have to multiply this with 2 because 1 CO contains 2 atoms. So 2 times 6.02 times 10 to the power 23. And you see this is not equal to Avogadro. Not equal, not equals to Avogadro constant. So option D is the answer.